the money. He raised the headstone up, so those just covered over. The one uh, the people that could pay, right, would have the headstones brought to the top. Yeah. When they after that storm, when they raised up Galveston. So I'm like this. I'm just fascinated by her, and I'm thinking about her, and I get into the thing, and I'm just talking to her, and I was like, how the heck did you get me from Louisiana? How did I know? You know, and I'm taking you, and you take to take the paper on. And I'm talking to her, and I start rubbing, and all of a sudden, it feels like somebody's grabbing me by the throat, and there's nobody there. Somebody is, what are you doing? It feels like somebody's grabbing me by the throat, and then, it's like this. You know, except for I'm not doing it. But you can see through, it's like I could see through fingers, you know? And I couldn't breathe, and I was like, what the shit? You know? And I'm packing things up, and I'm, I'm ripping it down, and they're still trying to help me. And you can feel, it's like from behind me. You know, you can feel it. It's very creepy and very scary, and I laughed, and it freaked me out, and I had to stop and sit on one of the little grave things before I could even get in the car. Because it was, I was trying to get to the car like this. They were still do whoever it was, whatever it was, was still doing it. And uh, and when I finally got to the car, this kind of eased up, but this was mm -hmm. still there. And uh, I was trying to just breathe, you know, and it scared me, it scared the shit out of me. What are you doing? Oh, that's pretty. I like that. Are you just videotaping everything? Yes. <laughs> I like that. Anyway, so I toss the shit in the back of the car. I mean, and it takes me a long, and it's not that far. It takes me a long time to get to the car because I keep having to stop and I keep saying, okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Let go of me. I'm leaving. I keep saying that, you know. I'm done. I'm like, Mary Jane, what the heck, you know. And I'm, I was talking to her, you know, yeah. while I was doing it, you know. I was like, I wonder what, how'd you get here? How many kids did you have? You know, that kind of stuff. And, all that. and, uh, and uh, so I get all the way to the raceway gas station, and I'm still feeling weird. And I go inside, and I'm like, okay. I just go in and get me a break, go up and pay for the break, and like, and I was like, oh, don't worry, just a little demon possession. How much is this? And he's like, you know, so I don't know what I look like here. You know, I didn't, really, I don't know what he's seeing, but he's like, I mean, he looked at me. He really looked at me. He's really odd. And I went out to the car, and I still felt too bad. Or was too, it was too weird. It was just too weird. And I called Josh to see if he wants to meet me at a little restaurant there. He used to be there. Apparently, isn't there anymore. And, uh. Just because I just didn't want, and I was scared to go back, and I didn't go back for the longest time, and I made it.